come a Mr. Wild, you young and all who live in Dale and Down. My song is of a fortune tall, and you live in Tidal Town. In blocking her is merry day, as well as slew both sheep and kine. And he drank his fill of the upper round ale in a bag of good red wine. One only sorrow which quelled his heart, as well it might quell mine. Just a fierce bright and a grisly ghost that dance in the pale moonshine. Or wander in the cold churchyard among the dismal tombs. Where hemlock blossoms in the day and by night the night shade blooms. Now it chanced upon a summer's day when the bells were blowing. But old Robin he rode over Tidal Moor and he heard the heath cock crowing. Well mounted on this forest nigh, he freely rode and passed. Never drew a rain till sparrow fit and plays low moss were past. Then slowly down the hill he rode into chapel on the frith, where at the rose of Lancaster he met with his friend the smith. While the parson and the pardoner to their took their daily draught, and when they spied a brother a coming, they all came out and laughed. Now hold the rain, thou jolly butcher, thou forest out and rider, on to Whaley Bridge, to Simon the Tanner, to sell this good cow hide. Thou shalt not go on stairs beyond till I might and supper with me. And when thou hast emptied me measure of liquor, I'll have a measure with thee. No, no, thou drowly smith, I cannot tarry today. For the wife she gave me charge to keep, and I dare and say her nay. For what likes of her that said the parson, then if thou sworn thou sure to rue. Thou mayst drink thy stoop and keep thy pledge like an honest man he may do. Oh no, no, thou jolly parson, I cannot tarry, I say. For I was drunk last night, if I should tarry, I'll be drunk again today. For what likes and that said the pardoner, then oh, I tell us thou that's to me. Thou mayst drink thy stoop this blessed night, and thy sins forgiven shall be. So down got the butcher from off of his horse, and the jovial wife was he. And he drank till the summer sun had set in that jovial company. Yes, he drank till the summer sun went down, and the stars began to shine. And his greasy noddle was ailed, and addled in the nut brown ale and wine. Then Robin the butcher was forced and away, and a what for Wayne was he? For sometimes his blood red eyes saw double and he could scarcely see. Oh, while the forest trees they seemed to dance as he rode so swift along. And the forest trees to his wild ascent sang the jovial song. As on he rode over Paislow Moss and down with the chamber knoll, where he was scared into mortal fear by the hooting arm of our now. Then on he rode with the forest edge of the deer brow silently. Then up the slack till on tight to moor his horse stood fair and free. Just then the moon from behind a cloud burst into open view. And all of a sword and purple heath brought light and a shadow through. It was then that the butcher whose heart beat fast with the fear of Grammarai. Fast by his side as he did by the foul phantom he did espy. I and even as swift as the butcher rolled while the ghost did grimly glide. Now down on the ground beside his horse, and now fast is her rein beside. All the lock and stock, all the stone and pit, all the hill and dale and down. Till Robin the butcher reached his door, stone in tides was good old town. Now what in the ales, thou drunken butcher, cried his wife as he sank down. And what in the ales, thou drunken butcher, cried a half of tides well down. I have seen a ghost, it hath raced my horse for a good six mile or more. And it vanished behind the churchyard wall as I sank down at the door. Bishop, thy heart for a drunken wretch, cried his wife as she held him there. 
Be sure to lie hard for a drunken wretch and a coward with heart to pair. No ghost of the race, thy horse this night, no nor even this wit with thine. Thy ghost was thy shadow, thou drunken wretch, and I would that ghost had been mine.